Robinson. Hey, good evening, guys. Yeah, the gloomy skies certainly have led us to think that we might see some rain today. So far, most of us have remained on the drier side. However, there have been some showers skirting our far southeasternmost communities from areas down around Mount Olivet over towards Maysville back towards West Union. But you can see even there now those showers are on the way moving out of the area. This is part of a bigger storm system that basically crossed its way across the bluegrass and parts of Tennessee, taking a large shield of rain into the Appalachians. I want to draw your attention though to how far back to the west though the low clouds extend all the way back towards the Mississippi River. So we are going to be stuck in the cloudy skies for a while and with some moisture kind of pivoting and rotating around this big system. I'm not going to even rule out the chance for maybe a very brief sprinkle overnight tonight. I don't expect most of us to see anything. So it's going to be cloudy and as we told you yesterday, much cooler with those clouds. Temperatures will hover in the 40s the next few hours, and then we'll see them begin to drop later tonight. Look at this compared to 24 hours ago as a result of those clouds. Notice 15 to 20 degrees colder outside. You may remember this time yesterday, many of us were in the low and mid 60s. So an uglier looking sky out there. Actually, it looks more like fall than it does spring for us right now. Chilly 45 degrees at the airport. When you factor in that brisk wind out of the north at 14, it certainly feels even cooler than that. So most of us today have been stuck in the middle to upper 40s. That's where we find ourselves right now. Generally around 45 or give a degree or two on either side of 45 around much of the metro. With those clouds in place, temperatures won't change much the next few hours. So it's going to be dry if you want to get out, take a walk, take a jog, stretch your legs. But no, it's much cooler than it was yesterday. All right, here's a look at future cast. The main area of rain continues to pull away and you'll see these little green dots occasionally. Uh, you know what? Again, I can't rule out a very brief sprinkle or even a stray shower, although most of us don't see anything. It's just simply kind of gloomy and cool and it stays that way through the night through tomorrow morning. And in fact, for much of your Wednesday too, it appears those clouds are going to be pretty stubborn for us. I'm trying to be optimistic and squeeze in some peaks at the sun tomorrow, but I'm uncertain exactly how much sun we actually see. Thursday would be a much better weather day in terms of how it looks and how it feels outside. So right now, cloudy, maybe a chance for a stray sprinkle or spotty shower tonight. Again, most of us are dry. We only drop to around 40, so we don't fall much tonight with those clouds. Still cloudy tomorrow, optimistically hoping for some late day sun. Cool, 54 for your afternoon high. Here's your day planner. We'll spend the first half of the day in the 40s, and then we'll get a hopefully at least a few rays at the sun during the afternoon. Here's your seven day forecast. Obviously, Mike and Sheree with more sunshine Thursday and Friday. Temperatures will respond nicely. We'll see them actually climb into the upper 60s and by the weekend reaching around 70. All right, Kevin, now.